Okay, so here's the uh, soda bottle, and um, using a box cutter, what we're trying to do is, is cut this bottle right here, just like that. Okay, now the bottom as well. Exactly, but let's, let's see if we can make it move. Okay, that's that, right? So now, uh, there's some glue there, so that's not going to be very, very uh, uh, clear. So that could go in the back then, right? So, so we're going to cut it now, like this way. Let's see if we can do that. getting there okay that's it all right so that and this in this way we have made the visor of the the uh, hazmat mask well you know the protection mask that we're gonna to uh, put together let's take a regular t-shirt Okay, so we got the regular t-shirt here, and we got the sleeves, so what we're going to do is make a knot, so we're going to knot on each sleeve, just like so, so now that's a knot right there, and then the other sleeve, Okay, so right here, make a knot over here. All right, so now the sleeves are sealed, right? Now we have this opening here for the neck. And this is what we're gonna do. So now, using this piece here, and a staple gun, we have to attach this to that, to cover this area here. So let's take this and open it up, and actually let's insert it first in here, in the hole of the t-shirt, right? And now that we got this one in the hole of the t-shirt what we need to do is go around like over there you know the best we can like on this side here and actually might work better if it's if it's facing the other way let's try to face it the other way face it out because you see it has a tendency to like curl so now if you face it out this way then we can kind of start going at it you know like that so now let's try this let's try to see if we can staple it over there right so here's this is the first right there all right that's holding so the thing is to go all around you know a couple of inches apart or so just to have that sitting right there okay you got that on the top and maybe get another one over here okay 
And now let's go back on this side too. So you can put another one over here. All right, so that's that's about right for that side. Now let's let's do the, the same on, on, on the other side as well here. Let's open this up. And okay. Now let's see this. Like there. We actually we can start as far as we can on this side, right here, right? And start over here. Okay. And let's staple it. And staple it. It's basically just to hold it in place for now because we're gonna apply some tape to like totally seal it afterwards, right? Yeah, I almost missed that one. That's okay. Okay, here's one more. Alright, so that's that. Now what do we have here? That's that's a visor already, okay? Now what we need to do is to seal it so there's no air going around like that, right? We need some duct tape. So let's take some duct tape. Okay, and you gotta apply it right there to seal it, right? So, go this way with it, eh? Uh, make it so that that hair is not in in, in the frame. So now that's gonna seal it in that direction like that, All right? There's one right there. Make sure it's all sealed, okay? Make sure it's all sealed just fine. And let's get the other side as well. Right here. Alright. This is the first time I'm trying this. As I was saying, it's the first time I'm trying this, so bear with me because I'm not even sure it's going to work or not, but uh, here it is. Let's see, let's continue here. So we're going to put the duct tape over on... Uh, start putting the duct tape right there and seal it that way. All right, and seal it, seal it, seal it, seal it, seal it. Okay, make sure it, it stays right there and it's all nice and, and, and tight. And it attaches to the thing right there. Okay. Well, that's that, right? Now, let's do this. the edges on, on the side. So we did top and bottom. Okay, here you go. All right, there, just like so. And this side here. That's about right. Okay. Place it right there. Alright, so now you seal it and make sure it's all nice and tight there. And that's basically your mask right there. Now all you have to do is, is put it on the on the head and, and uh have it going. Now there is a little bit of, of a leftover here, and I'm thinking I should cut that off so it's not gonna be Okay, if you look inside here, where is it? Okay, that's the entrance to the t-shirt right there. Okay, so if you look inside, see there's still like a little bit of a, of a roll up there. So let's see if we can cut that off. I mean, I was going to make it a little larger, but I guess that could work too. Or, or you know, this is the first design, probably going to get better once, once we get that. So we'll need that cutter again and see if we can cut it. Okay, so here's the cutter. Let's see if we can do this. Just cut this smaller. Okay, I'm not very good at cutting though. Maybe a scissors would work better, but anyway, so you get the idea. So anyhow, okay, so do this. Okay, so we put the duct tape here on the edges, on the inside. Uh, because we don't want to 
have it that 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 cutting edge rubbing against your face or your hair or ears or whatnot wherever they're gonna go so this is basically the face of your mask you gotta look through that and the tissue is gonna go over your head and, and, and around so it's gonna protect you all the way around where you can still see, out, see outside through this uh, let's see how that's gonna work well, of course I'm wearing glasses so so that's gonna be a challenge to see if, if it's gonna go over the glasses but that's the idea so so if I do this and then I pull this over my head and let it drape down and then I got this over here and, and that's about it you know and then if you want to tie it around your neck or not you know that that's up to you but uh, you know so you got you got some room to breathe now of course you might just get a little a little foggy there but that's the idea you know you can look around it's sealed so you're only breathing the, the air from the inside yeah whew. it feels interesting Yeah, and then if you add a poncho or something to to cover the rest of your body and gloves then uh you're almost there with your hazmat suit ready to face the outside and the enemy yep that's it now i'm not saying it's going to work but it's just something it's just something that could be could be implemented better probably and, and, and if, if there's nothing else uh, left out there, then hey, it's just a empty bottle of soda and a t-shirt. I mean, everybody's got those at home, right? Okay, stay safe, everyone.